Needs a hat and breeches. Hmm. So, come to test yourself. How so? Our warriors want your measure, Inquisitor. Bring us an offering, and we'll let you fight Hakon's tribes. Stonebear Hold would know if the spirits favor you. So would I. Do you run this arena? I do. I'm called Arkan Feltz. I prepare warriors for the gods. Truly? I drill it into young heads that no one's born knowing how the axe swings or the arrow flies. What do you mean, prepare your warriors for the gods? As we train, the gods see us become worthy. Worthy of what? A second strength when you most need it. A glimpse that spots a blade in your heart. Warriors must show their will for these gifts, and the will for practice. Impossible. These people would all be abominations if this were true. Our augur's no fool. We keep the bad spirits at bay, or spot them in those who draw them. I'm sure you think you do. What is this trial, exactly? Battle against our best. Wit and muscle, and steel against steel. Not to death, just surrender. In case you're afraid. That's a relief. Wouldn't want to widow the entire village. Oh, I like this. Bring the stomach to match those fine words. Can we begin this trial of Hakon? We need an offering from you first. To honor Hakon and the dead. Why do you pray to Hakon when his fanatics cause you so much trouble? Hakon Winter's Breath could be testing us through those fanatics. He could be a cruel god, Lowlander. He'll favor the victor and no other. Strength to strength. If the jaws of Hakon try to raid us, we'll feed their scraps to the bears. Farewell. Safe journeys. from the north. Why do they dress like that? Our guests are welcome. Walk in there with them.
Gods are welcome, so long as their weapons stay sheathed. speak about in the lowlands, aren't you? The Herald of Andraste. Many call me that. Helmsdim Rolfson. I trade our goods outside the hold. You'll not find better this side of the mountain. Have you traveled outside of Stonebear Hold? Korth Mountain Father provides. But press us, and we'll admit there's lowlander goods we can't craft ourselves. I sell our goods there. The old trader taught me how to read and write. ...and how to act in your cities. Where does your trading take you? Denerim and Southreach in Ferelden. Leeds and Verche in Orlais. When the passes are clear, I take our wares to Val Royo. Surely you can get a fair price for your goods closer than Val Royo. Ah, well... ...that's truth, but... ...have you seen it? My heart lies with the hold. But I'll die remembering the light on the gates of the sun. It's a city of plots and masks. There's rot below all that gilded paint. It's in all leisure nature to plot. They've not our strength, our ancestors, but they've built a wondrous thing. One could almost believe you admire Orlay. You sound like the Thane. Most in the hold call any city outside the mountains prideful or lowlander folly. Farewell. Another time. So, she arrives. Don't throng! Behold, worthy ones, the woman who blazes like fire and mends the air. Uh, that's a lot of... not good. What is this? Oh, demon summoning. Delightful. I am the ogre of Stonebear Hold. I greet you, as do our gods and the gods of our ancestors. <laughs> It is done. Now come, be welcome. But hear news of the North. I'd like to ask something. Then ask. I assume Augur is another word for mage. I am a mage. Yet not all mages are Augurs. I give counsel to other mages, and the same. In turn, an Augur takes counsel from the gods and shares it with the Hold. I make their will known to us, and ours to them. So you're an ambassador to the local spirits? They protect the hold. They help drive off spirits who've gone bad with rage or gloom. The gods live with us. Ignore their offerings, offer them nothing, and it weakens us all. I've heard enough to realize that when you say gods, you mean spirits. Why do you pray to them? We offer to them. We don't pray like the lowlanders to a creator they think will weather all the ages. Do you actually think they're divine beings? Something more than magic? The spirits watched us even before we came from the north. They shaped themselves into our gods, and we grew to love them. Their secret gift is this, Inquisitor. They reflect us as water does the sky. They show us what we wish to be. That image gives us strength. For that, we thank the gods. I should be off. Farewell. Our guests are welcome, so long as their weapons stay sheathed.
Inquisitor. I will speak with you later. Farewell. You're the Inquisitor. I hear your people already sing songs of you. How are you so well informed? Oh, Helsdim soaks up gossip when he goes trading. He just returned from the lowlands. I'm Fulna Hestotten, keeper of histories and skull to the hold. I've never met a skull. Is that anything like a bard? I suppose. Every hold has someone who sings its songs. Doesn't yours? Fair enough. We keep the old songs and histories, the oaths and the legend marks. I understood all of that, except legend mark. The skald before me was born Gulda Elstoff. She crafted a great new tale for the hold. It pleased the spirits. After that, we called her Gulda Gildan's song. So their titles, honorifics? Not all carry glory. My father was Heth Mule's head. <sighs> He'd never let go of a quarrel. Can you choose a legend mark for yourself? <laughs> only if I wanted to be scorned as a child. I've only been a scold a few years. I've not made any great feats, good or ill. Yet. Farewell. Good journeys. 